My name is Brighton. I want to get baptized because I want to show the people I love Jesus and I chose Jesus to be my Savior. I believe that Jesus came to earth to save us from our sins by dying on the cross and rising from the grave on the third day. My name is Brantley Rining. I am eight years old. I was baptized when I was 11 months old. I didn't know Christ when I was 11 months old. But now, thanks to my family in Calvary, I have had the chance to learn about the Bible and Jesus Christ. Today, I have decided to get baptized. I can't wait to grow my faith and learn more about the Bible and Jesus. Thank you. My name is Jordan, and today I want to get baptized. I've been feeling a calling telling me to get baptized. Galatians 3.27 says, For all of you who were baptized into Christ have clothed yourselves with Christ. I am ready to be clothed with Christ, and I want the world to know my love for Him and my faith and trust in Him. My name is Jerry Riding. Today I'm going to share my testimony with all of you. Last year, my life and my marriage hit rock bottom, and my addiction got worse and out of control. I didn't want to continue my life. I didn't know what to do. I admitted myself to the hospital, hoping for help. July 10th, 2023, I asked God and Jesus to come into my life, and I have been sober since that day. My faith and relationship with God has never been stronger. Thank you to my wife, my son, and his family, other family members, Pastor Aaron, and God for helping me through this journey. I am here today because I believe Jesus Christ died on the cross for my sins, rose from the dead to give me eternal life. My name is Claire Steffen and I stand before you today to publicly proclaim my decision of getting baptized. I've been a Christian as long as I can remember. I always knew that Christ died on the cross for my sins, but my relationship with Him was never my main focus. It was always, if I have time, I'll read my devotional. If I have time, I'll read my Bible. If I have time, I'll pray. I never made it a priority, even though I knew I should have. This past December, I decided to delete social media. My reason in doing so was to really find out who I was and grow in my relationship with God so that I could make Him my main focus, that I could spend my time serving Him and sitting in His presence rather than comparing myself and believing Satan's lies. I want to end with a verse of John 14, 6, that Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes through the Father except through Him. My name is Ivan Kaufman. Um, I'm choosing to be baptized today because like Christ who died on the cross and then rose again to life, I need to wash away my sins to start a new chapter in my life. I want to lead my family to walk in God's light, be a positive example of what He calls us to do as parents and as a husband. A new covenant with my Father in heaven above for a new day and a new beginning and a walk with Him. My name is Joe Zwick. It's hard to tell my story. So I've always believed the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. I believe that Jesus was born of Mary and was baptized by John the Baptist. He was crucified, died, and buried. He rose from the dead. He died for our sins so that I can be saved. I have hope, faith, and love for Jesus Christ, and I want to be baptized to show my life as a follower of Jesus. Hi, I'm Keely Hagee. I grew up a believer of Jesus Christ and had a very strong faith as a child. When I went to college, I got tugged in many directions. Something I was saving for my future husband was taken from me. I fell down a path of trying to fix my pain with everything but Jesus. Life without Jesus was living in hell on earth. God, however, did not leave me for the dead. In the past two years, I've been healing and pursuing a life with Jesus. Death no longer has a grip on me. I believe that Jesus Christ died on the cross for my sins and rose from the dead to give me eternal life. I'm Mindy Reining. Today I would like to share my testimony. When I met my husband, I was so happy he chose me and not one of my friends, which was usually the case. We got married in 91 and had our son in 94. Fast forward to June of 2023. My husband and our marriage hit rock bottom. I felt so alone and helpless and didn't know how to reach out to God for help. July 2023, Jerry received some intensive help with his addiction and we are rebuilding our lives and our marriage. 
Our kids invited us to Calvary and it's been a great move to strengthen our faith and our relationship with God. Thank you to Pastor Aaron for the talks and the hugs and giving us the guidance to pray and ask God for help in guiding our lives. I am where I am today because I believe Jesus Christ died on the cross for my sins, rose from the dead to give me eternal life, and because of my belief, I'm getting baptized today. My name is Claire Kramer, and I want to get baptized today to show everyone that I love Jesus and I want to follow Him for the rest of my life. I grew up in a Christian household where I've always known that Jesus Christ was my Savior. However, it was only after a serious car accident two years ago that I realized I had been missing something. It brought into perspective the fact that our days on this earth are fleeting, and that while I understood who Jesus was, I didn't really have a relationship with Him. Through what was a traumatic time in my life, I began my walk with Jesus. Now I want to get baptized so I can publicly declare my choice to follow Him. My name is Steve Kosti. I was raised in a small, rural, remote town in Southeast Oregon. We had a pastor come to our little one-room school once a month and give us a sermon. That pastor and my mother taught me that Jesus was the way, the truth, and the life. And I believed it with all my heart, and I still do. Throughout my life, I have had many trials. Through all this, God was there, giving me signs of hope, answering my prayers, and helping me through. It is only by the grace of God that I stand here in front of you today to proudly proclaim that I believe in Jesus Christ, died on the cross for my sins, rose from the dead to give me eternal life. My name is Jeannie Kosick, and I've been looking forward to this day for a long time when I could publicly proclaim my faith in Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior and get baptized like Jesus did to show my love for Him. In John chapter 3, Jesus says, we must be born again to see the kingdom of God. I couldn't do enough to earn my way to heaven. My old self was dead and my new life had begun. Since then, I wanted to make sure I could express my faith in Jesus in the way I lived my life to help save as many lives as I could so my loved ones could have eternal life in heaven with Jesus too. Hi, my name's Cody Wilkin. I grew up Catholic and not that there's anything wrong with it, but all I really did was go through the motions and never got the message from the Bible. In my college years, I drifted away from God, but in my adult life through marriage and kids, I have realized how important my faith and how I want to show my kids how amazing Jesus truly is and give them foundation on which to grow on. This church and the community here at Calabria has opened the doors to my faith and has strengthened the connection I have with Jesus. I have never been closer to Jesus and understand his message more now than I've ever been attending Calvary. Because of that, I want to get baptized and that I believe in Jesus, died on the cross and rose from the dead so I can have an eternal life. My name is Emily Wilkin. Um, I grew up in a Christian home and was baptized as an infant in the Lutheran faith. Though I have never stopped believing in our Savior, I did let life kind of sweep me on my feet and um, did not make my faith my topmost priority. What I have gained from attending Calvary is feeling God's love and the outreach through this community. I have felt empowered to put my faith in both fear and lead into God. I began talking to God through prayer more and often wanting a strong church relationship. I was able to see how miraculous life is and how fast it can go by. I hope to provide a good Christian foundation for my young children and continue to enhance our faith. I am so thankful Jesus died on the cross for our sins and rose from the dead for me to have eternal life, and I have chosen to be baptized today to dedicate my faith to God and to lead into my faith constantly through life's struggles and triumphs.